Good day everyone. In this video today, I will show you how to forward WhatsApp message to email. So to do this, firstly, go to the contacts you have the message from. Here is the contact right here. So you can then scroll up to where you have the message. So let's check where we have the message. Either from the contact or from you, it's still the same step for you to do in this video. So as you can see right here, here's a WhatsApp message right here. So the next thing for you to do is to long press the message, long press it. So when done long pressing the message, click on copy, which is this one right here. So right now as you can see, message copied. So the next thing for you to do is to go to your Gmail or Yahoo Mail, any of the two. So I'll be using Gmail in this tutorial. So let's go down to where we have Gmail. So click on it to open. As you can see, the Gmail app has been opened. So the next thing for you to do is to click on the compose message, which is one right here. Compose. But in some app, you will see a pen icon. Just click on any of the two. So when done clicking on the compose to bring out this box right here. So the next thing for you to do is to enter the email you want to send it to. You might also want to send it back to your own email. So you just enter any email of your choice. So let me send it back to this email. No, let me so let me send it to the email I want to send it to. So when done, click on the subject, then you enter the subject of your choice. So um, the WhatsApp, sorry, the WhatsApp message. So when done, where you have the compose email, you can then paste the message you copied from WhatsApp. So paste it right here. As you can see, the message has been pasted. So when done, click on the send button at the top right of the screen. As you can see, sending and message has been sent. So that's how to do this. Hope this video help. Please give it a thumb up and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. See you in the next video.